He's an Iowa pilot who's defying the odds and setting world records. He plans to soar again next month to celebrate his birthday. Not just any birthday, Ernie Smith will turn 99 and says he has no plans to be grounded. Tonight reporter Emily Zink catches up with the world's oldest pilot to find out what keeps him flying. There's something magic about it. Ernie Smith of Red Oak, Iowa loves to fly. You put the coal to it and get about 40 mile an hour, 50, suddenly she starts flying. His love affair with planes started when he was a little boy. They'd fly over just before dark and I'd sit out on the hill north of the house. Smith was hooked. He constantly thought about flying. I thought I knew how before I ever started, really. Smith got his pilot's license in his 20s. This one over here. The original hangs on the wall of the Red Oak Airport. That's when I first started flying in Omaha. He flew for decades, but in his 80s, Smith's wife urged him to stop flying. He was grounded for some time. My wife passed away about five years ago now. And one of the, one of the boys out here said, Ernie, You've got to get something to keep you living. An old flame was reignited. It's his first love. I always say this is dad's first love. In his early 90s, Smith reapplied for his pilot's license. Orville and Wilbur writes on it, see? Mm -hmm. A lot of people ask me if I knew him. No, I didn't know him. Every two years, Smith asked to see the doctor and pass a medical exam to fly. He said, well, see you in two years. I don't think so. And he said, well, why not? One month shy of his 99th birthday, amazingly, Smith still flies. We went to the Guinness Book of World's Record, looked up the current holder, and found out that Ernie was older. Red Oak Airport manager Kevin McGrew thought Smith deserved the recognition. I, I, I wasn't for it. I thought it was foolish. I said, I, I don't give a darn about that. I am doing what I want to do. He may not have been for it, but he went along with it. To be considered the world's oldest pilot by the Guinness Book of World Records, numerous documents needed to be submitted, including a copy of Smith's birth certificate and pilot's license, along with video of him flying. It became official this fall. Pilots will come in and will say, I'd like you to meet Ernie Smith, the world's oldest pilot. Well, <laughs> it's just another day and we're waiting for 100. Smith's children love that he is so passionate about planes. Oh, a Cessna 150. I always <laughs> wants to discuss airplanes with you. A 68 model. So that, that's pretty old. His great granddaughter Abby thinks his new record is pretty sweet. I can actually like prove to all my friends that it's real. He's the oldest one. For Smith, the record is great, but still being able to do what he loves is priceless. Most of the time, I make beautiful landings. Not always. Smith usually flies a few times a week, and on this particular day, he was itching to fly. Well, we'll take off to the south. We'll have a crosswind. Okay. High in the sky, the 98-year-old's love of flight was evident. Smith tells me he knows his hobby can't last forever, but for now, he's just enjoying the ride. Now you've ridden with the oldest pilot in the world. I know, that's awesome. Emily Zink. And not a lot of people can say that. KMTV Action 3 News. That is awesome. We thought you would like that. He's a character, right? The Red Oak Airport, by the way, already has booked a plane for him next year when he turns 100.